Hello and welcome to this lovely example of a Voga CTD V8 Range Rover. We'll start at this near side front corner as we always do. Tyre and wheel in great order. Tyres look new to be fair, There's loads of tread on those. Standing back a bit from it going down the near side. There's nothing to write home about on this car. It's a lovely, lovely example of one. Uh, as most of our cars are here, to be fair, they seem to be well looked after. So we've got some privacy glass to the front window, slightly lighter tint, and then the darker gangster glass to the rear, which really sets this car off. Um, it's got some nice detail bits, obviously the chrome door handles there, just bling it up a little bit. Got a slight scuff there to the quarter, but it doesn't feel that deep. That should flatten polish and you should get away with that. The odd little touch up as you can see there, and sort of door edges and one thing and another, but nothing to worry about. Car is lovely. Um, for its age and mileage obviously the overmats there in the back don't look like they've ever been used we've got rear entertainment in this car as well and heated rear seats um, the controller I think is all present and correct in here as well so we've got um, some sort of remote there that does it does it all TV1 TV2 and all that malarkey uh, is all on there so it's a complete car in the headrests here we've got uh, let me open that up the headrests as you can see they're all in there and there's the passenger side one in there in the back of that seat so coming around the back of the car it's got clear rear light lenses that fitted these black Range Rover badges just to give it a slightly different look which I've got to say does work obviously white lenses in the rear here as well uh, so you know it's a bit of a stealth look a bit blingy with those door handles it's all very good in the back here we have a full-size spare wheel as you can see under there and the all-important locking wheel nut is present the jack and all the other tools are all here okay it is subject to a cherish transfer um, but that uh, that is underway so we should have that back any time uh, I'll put notes on there if it's complete so uh, there we go mud flaps mats it's a typical uh, complete car this I don't think there's been any expense spared on it again the wheel and tires all matching all in great order and again down the off side of the vehicle apart from the odd stone chip uh, and the odd little polish mark here and there um, it is a lovely car again that wheel and tires in great order coming around the front of the car cars done excess of 60,000 miles there are a few chips as we can see here on the front bumper so you might want to paint the bumper uh, you may well leave it as it is and just have those touched in um, and again there's the odd little mark on the bonnet as we can see uh, so it will want a dose of touching in if you're going to mint it front screen looks in good order I've had a good look I can't see any obvious uh, bullet holes but uh, you never know uh, there will be the odd little mark here and there uh, but I can't see any so interior of the vehicle again this dark themes running throughout it so we've got the piano black inlays Harman Kardon hi-fi upgrade the uh, aluminium door shuts, electric seats obviously uh, with it being the, the Vogue SE, full leather and we've got ventilated seats as well as heated seats. Uh, full complements of handbooks, can't just put my hand on the service book so I'll put the service history on the, uh, on the net when I get that information shortly. But I can't think for a minute it won't have good history to be fair so do check that description. Inside the cockpit, it's done 64,201 miles. No warning lights displayed on the dash. Uh, mode, nav, okay. Agree, so it's a touch screen nav, as you can see there. Uh, all working. Destination, no. So you can see all that set up there. We've got dual zone climate control, uh, heated and ventilated seats. We've got in there, it's just a standard. Yeah, all fairly standard. We've got the sunroof as well, which all works, as you can see there. Beautiful, lovely day here today as well. So there we go. We've got um, uh, remote uh, gate and door openers, auto dimming rear view mirror. So it's a full, complete car. Um, cruise control, electric steering, column adjust. Um, so yeah, nothing two keys uh, an auxiliary I'm not sure what that does but it's uh, I think it's something to do with the preheating but I'm not sure I'm sure your knowledge is better than mine I've got folding door mirrors electric doors auto headlights 
Again, it's a lovely, lovely car. If you're going to buy yourself a Range Rover, oh, memory seats as well, as you can see down there. If you're going to buy yourself a Range Rover, it's probably the one to buy. It's done it some majority of its depreciation. And there we go. So, winning bidder, please feel free to download the photos, get it straight on the, on the web, ready to retail. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.